What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Captain Price with Captain Price TV, and you already know, <laughs> dude, what I just did, though. But hey, I told I, you, you all probably like, I, I thought you don't do editing in story times. Well, for now on, for every story time, I will be using that caption right there. Reason being, because I want story time to feel like you're getting told a story. So today, is you see the title of the video. I'll be talking about the first time I got drunk. I didn't say the first time I drank. The first time I got drunk. Why? Why? It's like, no. So, basically, I sat here. It was my 16th birthday. I always remember this. Crazy, right? You get drunk on your 16th birthday. Um, I, ironic, ironically, who I got drunk with, it's crazy too. He was a few years younger than me. Uh, play cousin, um, friend of the family. Um, so it was my 16th birthday. Got a little bit of ganja, you know. Got um, got some bottles, you know. He chose to get um, his gin, gin and juice. Um, crazy part to this whole story is my bottle I didn't pay for. I stole it. I stole it out of my mother boyfriend's little um stash she had at my mother's house and I, mean, I, I actually my house but basically i i kidnapped it i am not going like kidnapped it to ribby mine you know brown liquor you know nothing big nothing you know something slight kidnapped it um basically i drunk i drunk it <laughs> we hit a few blunts <laughs> i didn't that crazy part of the whole story is we he we was he had me drinking some of his gin and juice too before we ended up going back to my house. Um, first of all, I thought my mother was gone for the weekend, like some just some whole movie stuff. You would think think my mother was gone for the weekend. Come from out, she wasn't even gone for all day. Um, went ahead and got towed up, popped a little bottles, you know. Got drunk. Once I got halfway through the bottle. Rewind this. Why in the, I know y'all probably like, why in the world did he who he think he was gonna get away with any of this? I did think I was gonna get away with it. To the day I still think I get could have got away with it. But now I am a little bit oh yeah, I don't think I could. Because first of all, how was it gonna get replaced? I'm a sixteen year old what I'm gonna spend my allowance money on somebody else's bottle? <laughs> Not happening. Um so He said he, I, my mother came back. He he up there, toe up. He up there on the chair like this. I had like a little setup similar to it. No, not similar. I only had like a um, uh, like a little thing. You know those things you have in the garage and stuff. But I had a desktop though, um, a little Dell desktop. I had it for some years, and I still had HP on it. He right there on the desk like this. Like he toe up. You know, we. I'm talking about he had about. Little fifth, I think half a fifth. I don't, I'm not too sure. I forgot, but it's about that big. Um, I'm in general I drink my paints and stuff now, so you know I ain't getting nothing that big. So he end up, he end up being like this, and but the crazy thing too, we had the windows open. Reason why we had the windows open because we were smoking. We ain't supposed to be smoking in the house, but we were smoking in the house. So we end up, I end up opening. We end up having the windows open. All we, all I heard was my mother pull up. I looked out the window, cause I'm here making sure, you know, my mother pull up out of nowhere. We was like, oh shit, that's like, <laughs> like this. We was like, oh shit. So we get out of the car. I said she got out of the car, and I didn't mean to say that, yeah. So we end up trying to hide everything. He already had his gin and juice and uh, what was it? I think it was pineapple and orange. Ever fresh bottle about that big, but he had still had his bottle though, so I ended up having my cup rolling the bottle. I rolling the bottle underneath my bed. The bottle was already open. The bottle wasn't even closed. Rolled my bottle underneath the bed. Had my cup through the cup underneath the bed. The thing I think to this day, I don't think if we never smoked, I think we would have never got caught up with. The drinking, because the smoke threw everything off. My mother knew about it. Was like, 
Y'all, y'all mom, why are you smoking it, man? I'm like, ma, 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 ma. You know, you know, 16, you know, you want to turn up, 16th birthday, you know, turn up. But, um, come to find out, it ain't going to well, man, you know. Um, I was very turned up. I drank a half a bottle of Remy Martin. When I mean half a bottle, that was a fifth. Now, I didn't paint a fifth of Remy Martin, and I, and I, and I demolished. I damn near demolished it. It was a brand new bottle. I opened it. Had about it was only had about this much in the excess of the little stuff that I dropped. I'm tore up. He's tore up. My mother, luckily he lived up the street. My mother ended up making him go home, walk up the street. My mother said these exact words to me. She said, "You think you're grown, huh? You think you're grown? <laughs> I got something for your ass. That's excuse my French, y'all. I got something for y'all. You. You gonna wake up with a hangover." I knew what a hangover is, but I didn't never had a hangover. Woke up with a hangover. Let me remind you. Hangover, you take certain things to get rid of the hangover. You know, you can drink another shot to kill it back. Huh, kill it. Or you can do other things like take some BC with ginger ale or something like that. Um, other things you could do with it. Um, sleep it off. Um, that wasn't happening with me. Mom Deuce had other plans. First off, she clearly sat there and took me with her everywhere she went. I had a total migraine, woke up at 8 o'clock. Let me remind you, I already went to bed at like 12. Woke up at 10 o'clock. Not 10 o'clock, 8 o'clock. Mother woke me up, picked up her grand, her godmother, rest in peace to her. <laughs> and they, they, they tormented me the whole ride. Because I was towed up, <laughs> she, was, you know, my mother, grand, grandmother was like, "Oh, so you think you're grown, huh? You think you're grown? You smell fifty like alcohol. You think you're grown and you smell like alcohol. You're a little alcoholic." <laughs> <laughs> you nasty said it just like that. You little alcoholic. You you think you're grown? You my mother was like, and he now you got a little hangover, and he was gonna have to ride with us the whole time. Let me remind you. I didn't get nothing for that hangover. It was a lesson marked to that hangover. I should have never did it. You know, I was underage drinking. Did I learn my lesson from that? No. It's fast four years late. Not years, but a couple months later, I did the same exact thing. Not the same exact thing. I didn't get toe up, but I took some shots and stuff. But I'm a, when it comes down to me drinking, I didn't drink many of times alcohol, not wine coolers or liquor uh, or beer I mean I drunk many of the times um I drunk a lot of stuff um but my favorite is Grey Goose and Absolute um I would prefer Grey Goose over Absolute any day um if I'm drinking brown I'm gonna drink some Remy I got end up liking Remy um but the thing about it is is like don't drink as a young age cause you build your, your tolerance isn't good but what I was trying to say Though, I don't know why I'm jumping the subject to subject. First off, I only earned six times out of my whole life on being under the influence. I blacked out once. Um, I earned five times. It might have been less than that. Um, I'm not a I, I'm not a person that I'm not a lightweight when it comes down to drinking. I might I my anybody tell you he could talk clear and everything, but in me, I know that I'm toe up. My walk, I'm walking. I walk like, but I would not talk like it. Um, I still have a conscious mind, but I can still feel that I'm wibbly. But, um, you know, a lot of times, you know, drinking isn't really good for you unless you're doing it for health reasons. Um, what I mean by that, like wine and all that other stuff. Um, you know, red wine helps the blood. Um, you know, you know some people don't know this. Whiskey is good, too, to put on wounds and stuff. Um, me in general. Um, I don't keep that type of stuff. I had somebody donated me some marijuana liquor before. That stuff was disgusting. It was very disgusting. I was like, no wonder they gave it to me for free. Um, do anybody think about 
doing anything like that when they turn 16 and all this other stuff, it ain't fun being drunk. Because first of all, you don't know how it's going to turn out that night. It could turn, oh, that day, you don't know how it's going to turn out. You don't know it's going to turn bad or good. Um, you can drink. Sometimes you can get drunk and be like, yeah, I don't never pass out. And you end up passing out. Or you can get drunk. I don't pee, never pee on myself. And end up peeing yourself. Um, I never pissed on myself drunk. Never will. Um, because it's, it's all about limits. You don't want to be never be pissy drunk. Never want to be pissy drunk, y'all. Um, so that's about it. Don't never, don't never drink. And one thing, don't never drink and drive. I repeat, don't never drink and drive. Because my friend on my aunt passed away from that. She wasn't drinking and driving. The person she was driving was. Don't never drink and drive, y'all. A lot of you not. It's not good to drink and drive. Um, Because a lot of things can happen when you drink and drive. Um, So, I guess I'm going to close y'all out like this. Um, Make sure y'all turn on, turn on notifications. Press that little red button right there. Say subscribe. Subscribe to it. And... Drop a like on this video if you like it. Um, another thing before I go. Any thumbnail um, apps or anything for the computer. Not for phone. I, my homeboy already told me about the phone apps. But anything for the computer for Mac. Um, please feel free to drop into the description. I'm not the description. The comment section. And go ahead tell me because I really need better thumbnails. I know you, a lot of people have told me that my thumbnails are terrible be, and that's probably why I'm not generating. And they are terrible. I know they're terrible. I don't know the apps. Um, some people tell me they're alright. I, I don't feel like they're alright. Um, you know, a lot of people I see do a bunch of thumbnails. But this is not what this video about. But my name is Captain Price and this is Captain Price TV. Live life to the funnest, not the fullest, and I am out. You did. If you want to live life to the funnest, subscribe right now. It ain't nothing but a G thing. You did.